and Naman hai. Now, let's welcome Sanchi and Nishit for an English speech from class 9th. उस दिन तारों ने देखा हिंदुस्तानी विश्वास ने आ जब लिखा महारण वीरों ने खून से अपना इतिहास ने आ A glorious good morning to all of you. I am Rishat Ray and I am Sanchi of Class Nine. Welcome you all from the bottom of our heart on the 75th Independence Day. Before we start, can anyone describe what the independence is? Anyone? Yes. Nice. Sanchi, can you tell? Yes. Independence is doing the right thing on your own. Absolutely true. I think we can describe independence in some other way also. The freedom fighters struggle for this day. Yes, it is Independence Day. The firing of guns ended this day. Yes, it is Independence Day. Saffron, white and green are seen everywhere. Yes, it is Independence Day. Today we should feel proud to be part of an independent nation that has freedom of speech, freedom to live life in our own way. At the midnight of 15 August 1947, when our vibrant India got freedom, our first Prime Minister, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, gave the wonderful speech Rise with destiny, starting with the words At the stroke of the midnight hour, when the world sleeps, India will awake to life and freedom. Freedom, when it begins to take root, is a plant of rapid growth. Life without freedom is like a body without spirit. Because of this struggle of our valiant freedom fighters, today our nation is an independent nation. Ma Mahatma Gandhi also known as Babu, joined the fight in 1914 and led the country to independence using his method of non-violent protest. While Subhashendra Bose, also known as Netaji, followed the policy of Tum mujhe khun do, main tumhe azade dunga. Bhagat Singh, Chandrasekhar Azad, Sarosi Naidu, Lala Rajput Roy, Gurudev and many others fought for our freedom. Patriotism is not only present on our incredible democratic land but also in the space. Rishi, can you give us an instance of this? Yes, Sanji, of course. On 2nd April 1984, Mr. Rakesh Sharma was the first Indian who traveled in space and was asked by the Prime Minister of that time, Sri Mati Indra Gandhi, that, Upar se Bharat kaisa dikta hai? He replied, Sare jahan se achha, Hindusta hamara. So this is the beauty of our India and the patriotism in the heart of every Indian. We are celebrating Independence Day here, as well as our <coughs> Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi and others at the Red Fort. While courageous soldiers of our country are on the border lines, protecting us in all the adverse conditions. 26 January 1950 was the day when India's constitution came into effect and the country became republic. This was the first step taken towards the nation's development. In its 75 years of independence, it has built a modern economy, lifted millions out of poverty, made the democracy, and become a space in nuclear power and developed robust foreign policy. And also, we can't forget our late president, Dr. A.P.J. Abdul Kalam, the missile man of India. Today, we are not only here just to celebrate, but our nation needs more than anything. No doubt we have a free land, but this free land is surrounded by hosts of problems like overpopulation, poverty, unemployment and many more. And being the youth, we are the future of our nation. We have to be united and uh, we need to look at the problems and find the solutions. So let's forget the division of color, caste, creed and believe in variation of our nation and come forward and join our hands together. And promise to make all the possible efforts to make our India again. Sone ki chariya. Before we conclude, let's take a pledge. We are the pride of the young nation. We, we pledge for a united India. India. Long, Long live our mother, mother India. India. Thank you so much for your attention attention and interest. Jai Hind!